What's good everyone? What is good? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Machiavelli and we're making a build. Yes, in today's build we are re well, remaking, but we are making, I don't know, some type of, I don't know, it's a farmhouse style, but then it's also like an urban, urban farmhouse. I don't know. I tried something. Let me be. Um, so yeah, hopefully you'll enjoy it. I, I, I honestly don't know what style this is, but I'm going to call it urban farmhouse that sounds interesting but there we go we're gonna call it that but anyways if you guys want the links yeah i'll know it's down below um some links don't work i can't sorry sadly some of the i like i said before the cc that i have is over like four years old so a lot a good amount of the old cc the people don't have their um their, what's it called again? Their uh, page is up anymore, so they're gone now, so you guys can add that. But anyways, I'll try to find some, you know, what's it called again? The one thing I can't find is the pillows. The pillows, if y'all can link me to some nice, like, pillows that I can, like, put in the links for you guys because I honestly can't find any that look as good as the ones that are gone now. Let me know. That'd be, that'd be great. But anyways, this is actually the house from, I think I built it. It was, it was from the last build. Um, yeah, this, so this is the interior of it. So I hope you guys are excited for it and hope you guys enjoy it. Um, sorry guys. I'm not even tired. I don't know. Today's been a long day. I've been up since 2 o'clock. I'm actually trying to fix... I'm, 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 I'm on a mission to fix my sleeping schedule. And my body's trying to come down. Um, I woke up. I had a high. I went to school. Okay, no, I didn't get high. But like, I, I, you know when you wake up and you feel well rested? Well, I, I call it a, a wake up high. Anyways, moving on. But anyways, I got up. I felt great. I did some homework. I went to school, and now I'm just I don't know. I I'm just whenever I do these builds, I just feel so chillaxed. Just like I, I can talk myself. Okay, guys. Here's a little thing. I you guys already know this, but I'm into ASMR. Mm -hmm. If you're asking me what's ASMR, search it up. It's great. I love it. Um, I'm into though. I I don't know what it is, but. I'm into eating sounds, right? And I, I, I think I ever told you guys about how I got into it. Um, I'll tell you guys anyways, you don't even know. Well, anyways, I was in grade what? I was in grade, I was in grade two. Oh god, in grade two. And I was in class, and the te I asked the teacher to come and help me read over my assignment. And when she came over, she always used to eat these peppermint candies. And so literally, she, she was just sitting there eating them while she was looking over my work and talking to me. I wasn't paying attention to her work. I was just focusing on her eating the candy, and I felt so relaxed. See, that was that was me. Um, <laughs> that was me experiencing ASMR before ASMR was even a thing. But yeah, that was me in like what? Yeah, that was me in grade two. Oh, good times. And then I actually started developing it because I actually downloaded this Korean app. I don't know what it's called anymore. But I downloaded this Korean app. And I used to just watch a bunch of Korean people eat food it wasn't like asmr but like i don't know i just found it, it looks cool and that was even before i even got into like korea if that makes any sense i don't know i, I found that app in grade eight and i didn't really start getting into like the korean culture till like grade 11 so i was like what i knew about mukbang before mukbangs were a thing mm-hmm I'm a hipster. I'm oh, not a hipster. What's that? What's, what's that thing? What uh, is there even a word for it? Talking about when um, you. Oh, that's my chair. I was like, what the heck's making that sound? But anyways, is there a word for like when you um, when you're a fan of something before it becomes popular? I think there's a word for it. But that's me with mukbangs. I was, I was watching it back in 2000, and I don't even know. Like, what? When was I in grade eight? I don't even know what year that was. But that was a long time ago. That was over 10 years ago. <laughs> 10 years ago. So 10 years ago, that was. And years from now, from now, 2009. Yeah, I was listening to that stuff from 2009. So, mm-hmm. I'm popping. Anyways, moving on from that. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, I, yeah. So, like, me, like, I won't even lie. Sometimes I listen to, like, my voiceovers again sometimes, and it soothes me. I don't know. Like, people say I have a calming voice, and it's true. But I really do have a calming voice sometimes. Sometimes when I'm not, like, being all weird, I have a calming voice, and sometimes it soothes me this evening, so, so, yeah, I don't know, I guess every time I do a commentary, I just get all chilled. Why am I telling you guys this? I don't know. Too much information? I think so. But anyways, um, hope you all having a great day today. I'm doing great. Um, I love this build. I love all the funky colors I added to it, like, I added some green, added, bruh, y'all, there's something wrong with me. I love yellow. I never thought this would happen. Um... I didn't really add any yellow in this build, you know? <laughs> so that's the thing. That, that's how I know that was a, a... This is the thing. 
know I know I'm addicted to something is when I have to force myself not to use it. Like for example, in The Sims 4, I'm addicted to these um to these paintings, but I force myself not to use it because I use it in every other build, you know? And now yellow, I'm addicted to yellow. Like I literally want to put like a yellow walls in and like a yellow chairs and little accent pieces of yellow. But then I was like, no Malik, I'm gonna use green and some other colors. I have to force myself not to use yellow. So now I know I like yellow, but I don't even like yellow that much. Like I would never catch myself wearing actually no I have a yellow shirt, that's it. But um I don't know, but yellow is something. Yellow is just something nowadays. But um, anyways, I hope you guys do enjoy it. I actually like this build a lot. I love the contrast of the white with the gray, not the gray, and the brown chairs, and then you go into the kitchen. Like, it's weird because the living room looks totally different from the style of the kitchen and the dining room. You would think that I would carry on the brown sofa to, you know, the living room but I got but I kind of forgot and I kind of just lost it so right now you're seeing one thing I totally change it up it does not look like that at the end I, I change it up because um, I don't know I just didn't like the couch uh, I, I like white couches but I don't know I can only use truly two couches why am I always yawning in these videos somebody help me but um yeah I don't know I can only use a a type of like white couch and this isn't it I didn't like it that much so I ended up changing it at the end because I like that I have all this empty space I changed the layout yeah here it is I'm changing the layout of it and how it looks but um yeah that's pretty much it for me talking about this build I hope you guys yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it if you guys do enjoy it the links will be down below um I will not I if this is not uploaded to the gallery I'll have tray files and I'll upload it tonight so yeah here you go but um anyways so today is thursday i actually want to go ahead and talk to you guys real quick i like i don't want to see i don't like talking about the subject a lot because like it's a very touchy subject and like you can go from one thing to another and it gets really heated um we're going to talk about racism mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yes we're going there today because i don't know if you guys I don't know if you guys, I'm pretty sure you've seen it in the news, but the Meghan Markle thing and Prince Harry, I'm not a, I'm not say a big fan, but I don't, I, I don't, I don't pay attention to that type of stuff, that, that ain't for me, but I will say I understand where she came from, and the one thing I don't understand is for people, because I know there's a lot of people that, that, I don't know, this is one thing I want to, like, like I see I feel like I'm judging the one thing I don't do is generalize right so I know I have some people from the UK and I like I like I, like, I want a dead set like I want you guys to explain to me because I'm ignorant to the culture down there like I watch UK TV shows and it seems fine but from what I've read and what some like comments I've seen um because I know you guys know I'm a UK junkie in a sense I love watching UK shows um and so I, I have some stuff on my uh, so I think there's something called the Sun Paper if you guys know what it's called I don't know clue yeah I'm not from the UK but there's something called like Sun and this this like the Sun there's another thing hold on let me go to Instagram real quick I'm not following them but they're always on my feed. Uh, let's see if I can find what's called. It's something magazine. I don't even know. But anyways, uh, but whenever they showed something about Meghan Markle, um, like bruh, y'all, it was the comment section was vicious. Like y'all, people hate her. I I just want to know why y'all hate her, because I I I just I I I I don't I don't get it. Like. Y'all hate her for some reason, and the things that y'all say just like I have to talk about this real quick because I saw this one thing that really messed me up. Um, like it ain't cool to sit there and provoke someone and call somebody a monkey. Like what kind of? Oh my god, I was so pissed when I saw it too. Someone's like, look, saying, telling her because she was wearing black one day. She's like, oh, looking like a monkey. I'm like, like you don't even want to hit somebody across the screen. Like you want to go like. I just want to hit them I, I got so pissed off because what was like guys she's literally sitting there in a black dress and y'all are making fun of her like y'all bully this girl to the point of no return and then the racial comments oh my god like the thing is I have a thick skin and not a lot of thing can piss me off like I, I I literally you can sit there and disrespect me as long as you don't disrespect my family then we good but you can disrespect me as much as you want to, and I won't budge. I won't budge because you're not, you're not you're you're not worth my time. But um, <laughs> that's it. If you're gonna sit there and make fun of me, then you're not worth my time. You're not worth my breath. Carry on. But um, what I'm trying to say is, I read these comments and they pissed me off. Like I was fuming, <laughs> fuming. Anyways, no. But I was really pissed off though because 
where is this negativity kind of like what made you get up like no i'm just gonna talk about this girl's skin color and make fun of her for it today because i feel like being an asshole like why like for the people who live in uk like is racism a big thing i just need to know that because I'm, I'm like as i said i'm ignorant to the point because i just don't see where this is coming from you know i don't know maybe it hasn't developed i don't know black people haven't developed in uk yet so it's not a thing down there or mean people i don't i just don't know but we're in 2020 how are people still over there like y'all being like it's not even like you know the little comments you'll see there and there but it's like blunt racism even in magazine titles you know like it's just ra bruh like honestly though i like my head hurts just thinking about it because I've seen some ridiculous things. I felt like I have to talk about it because like one thing I don't f with is bullying, and y'all bully this girl to no like to no end. Like I'm like I'm I'm actually furious right now from all the things she's like. like again, I said I don't I don't I don't talk about the royal family. That that ain't my business. So they don't interest me. But what I just don't like is bullying and. I've seen so many topics about her and the things that she has went through and the things that have been said. I don't even know. Y'all out here calling her a gold digger and stuff. Like, y'all don't even acting like y'all. That's one thing I don't like. People out there, that, that's one thing I don't like about, like, gossip members, like, anything. I'm talking about, I'm talking about, like, the Kardashians, Beyonce, whatever. Stop acting like you know these people. People be out there like, oh my god, these people are snobs. Like, look at them. They're so full of themselves. Oh, they're they're rude. They're beaches. You know, you don't know these people. Why are you out there making comments about them when you don't even know them? Like, what kind of foolishness are you? Like, the clownery. How are you gonna sit there and say this person's this type of way when you only you haven't even met them? Like, what? Like, what? What gives you the right to talk ish about somebody and you haven't even met them before? Like, that's the one thing I hated. Like, I'm literally, like, again, I, I don't generally lost gossip sites. I used to. But, like, the people out there, like, oh my god, the Kardashians are so fake. How do you know they're fake? Like, I don't, like, I generally, I won't say I like them. I, I Like, I don't know them, so I don't like them or hate them. But, like, how do you know they're bad people? Have you talked to them? Have you, have you, like, hung up with them? Like, you don't know them how are you judging them like i don't understand this like why can't you just like be positive why is this world so flipped and negative sometimes like i have to like i'm kind of like i'm ranting right now because i hate it like i remember i commented on a something right and some person said no you're doing it the wrong way i'm like listen 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 listen, listen. Not, okay okay i'm explaining it wrong so it was a k-pop situation right I'm doing a whole other thing. But it was a chaos situation and some person put their nose in it. It had to be negative. I'm like, listen, you could have sat there and been positive and mind your business because what I said did not affect you. But you had to go ahead and stick your nose into this and be negative for no reason. Like, we're in 2020. Like, why can't we be happy this year? Like, why is there so much flipping negativity around? Like, I can't even right now. I'm sorry. I had to rant about this because I actually last night went into, like, this whole fight with, um some person on twitter i went to a twitter fight dead set and then i saw the whole megan markle thing and i'm like oh yeah i understand why she's doing that and then i read the comments i'm like bro you're still at it <sighs> anyways yeah for anyways the people from the uk like is racism like i don't i don't again i don't know what it is so if y'all can like brush up with me like how is it down there like i, I this is a weird thing to talk about because i know this is a touchy subject but i just i need to know i'm curious and if you don't want to talk about it, that's totally fine. I'm not going to sit here and put a gun to your head and be like, hey, tell, tell me, tell me. No, 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 no. Listen, if you don't feel comfortable talking about it, don't talk about it. I'm not going to be here and stress you about it. But I'm just asking a serious question because y'all be trifling down there. Like, like the, some, the things y'all say. Anyways, and I know, and the thing is too, I don't want to generalize a whole, a whole country um, for the comments I've seen. But bruh, like, I'm taken back. But anyways. I thought I'd go ahead and talk about that real quick because I don't know, I just have to get some stuff off my chest. But moving on from that, I just want to say, y'all, we're in 2020. Be effing positive. Like, don't be negative. That's the one thing I'm trying to be right now in my life. I actually have, no, because sometimes, you know, I'd go and be like, oh my god, like, what are you wearing? You know, listen, look the other way. Like, be positive. That's that should be everyone's motto be positive if you don't got something nice to say don't say it don't comment it skip through it leave the tab leave the page leave the leave the link whatever don't be negative i'm just i'm trying to install that into people because bruh the negativity sometimes 
irks me. But anyways, guys, I'm going to end off this commentary here because it's way too long. I'll see you on the next one. I'm out. This is peace. Bye. Later. Bye, guys.